Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Lavish Roblox. Today I'll be covering the 13 worst updates on Roblox. Let's get into the video. Number 13, removing Lifetime BC. Lifetime Builders Club. It was $50 for normal, $129 for turbo, and $350 for outrageous. So what was Lifetime BC? Well, it's sort of on the name. If you bought Lifetime BC, it would never expire. Removing Lifetime BC was a money hungry thing to do. See, when Roblox removed Lifetime BC, they replaced it with Annual BC, which cost the same as Lifetime did. So now you have to pay 50 or 350 every year for BC. Number 12, Default Clothing. The Default Clothing is a group of pants items unavailable and unviewable in the catalog that are applied to an avatar when no pants are selected. It's likely this was made to repel online daters from creating avatars that would be rendered inappropriate. Default Clothing was added in an update on June 16th, 2019. The default clothing looks like a colored shirt and the small Roblox logo located in the top left corner of the shirt in a pair of shorts. Number 11, Moderation System. The product contains a user reputation system where players' chat capabilities with the filter can be restricted or lessened based on their history of chat abuse. Though not confirmed that Roblox utilizes a user reputation system, it can explain the frequently criticized phenomenon of players being moderated for content that other players receive no reprimands for. Many users frequently criticize that appropriate words such as my, I, or don't are usually flagged by the filter. Number 10, Unobtainable Limiteds. The prices of many limited items have been pushed to exorbitant amounts by those who own it, which frustrates users who want to purchase them but can't afford due to extreme inflation. And either leading others to think that Roblox is greedy to push others to buy thousands of dollars for just a single limited item. Number 9, New Robux Icon. Many new players say that the new icon looks ugly and want the old one back. However, the change was not a big surprise to some players, as in early 2019, the icon was found in the Roblox files. Number 8, Lack of 4th Generation iPod Support for Games On December 7, 2012, when the Roblox mobile app on the App Store was updated, Roblox received criticism for instead of having a support for the iPod and iPhone that are of the 4th generation and beyond, they decided only to have support for the 4th generation of the iPhones in the iPod 5. Number 7, NBC Restrictions. On December 12, 2012, the day the full play on mobile feature was released, Roblox announced that Builders Club users could play all games, but NBC users would be limited to a rotating curated selection of games. This was met with a large amount of criticism from the Roblox mobile user base due to Roblox's decision. Number 6, Ticks Removal. On March 15, 2016, Roblox announced that a blog post that tickets would be discontinued the following month claiming that the currency was causing confusion and delay for many first-time users. Although it was suspected that this was because Roblox has been undergoing financial difficulties, no evidence has ever been shown for this. Number 5, Arthro. Arthro is the second most recent addition to avatar types for Roblox, first revealed during Roblox Developers Conference 2017. The definition of the word anthropomorphic is given as the state of having human qualities or characteristics, hence the name Arthro. However, it was renamed to Arthro in October 2018. It's believed that the team Arthro is a portmanteau of Roblox Anthro. Number 4, Advertisements. Roblox Mobile has been known to have an excessive amount of ads that don't pop up on the computer. Usually some games have ads that pop up only when you join the game. Some creators have started to make their games have ads that appear very frequently. Number 3, Temporary Server List Removal. On July 13, 2017, the servers would only show what server the player's friends are in. This caused a major uproar in the forums as players are no longer able to see all servers for good, and sometimes are forced to rejoin the same server or the server their friends are in repeatedly. Number 2 Removal of Game Genres On October 26, 2017, game genres were removed from Roblox. This has caused major outrage in the forums, however, it's possible that it was a glitch because the genres are still listed on every game page and still exist in the catalog. Number 1 New Roblox Building Tools Shortly after Roblox has released new building tools, many users say they are limiting the creativity of many games because of the limited variety of new blocks and the fact that it is often very difficult to use any other tools, free models, decals, or even the user's own items. There are many complaints that the new blocks are not compatible with the classic bricks, also some of the tools have been criticized for glitches and not functioning properly. This brings us to the end of our video, hope you enjoyed it, hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also watch the two videos that are on your screen, cause I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video, so long.